This is the only refuge of its kind in New South Wales. Two out of every three women who apply for a space here have to be turned away. Not bad. Getting there. Yeah, yeah. Yvonne is one of the lucky ones. My girls. A former <laughs> resident, she's visiting today to offer hope and support by sharing her story. I was with my husband for almost 50 years and there was my two daughters, my three grandchildren, and we all lived together right till the day my husband passed away. And I don't know whether it was grief, whether my children just didn't accept that my husband wasn't around, I'm not sure. But, yeah, finance and money come into it and then I wasn't able to stay. So three or four months after my husband passed away, in her words, she said it was her house now and she didn't want me. I wasn't welcome there. Just before the Christmas, um, she said, you have five days. No. I packed everything I could and put it into storage, what I could. And that was the, on the Monday, I asked if I could sleep on the lounge on the Sunday night. And, and then my other daughter dropped me off. In, in on the corner in Campbelltown. I had a suitcase with some clothes. So I didn't know what I was going to do. And the biggest memory I've got is I read my little grandson. He was eight. When I got dropped off, he was hanging out the window and he said, come and get me, Nana. Don't forget to get me. You really don't know because we had such a great life. We had everything we needed, everything we wanted. I never thought I'd end up homeless. I don't think people understand that there are women of this age going through things like this and people like Yvonne who have you know, they've worked hard all their life, they've raised families, They're, they haven't been reliant on, you know, government benefits or ever access any kind of service before. And then to find themselves with nowhere to go, they don't know who to ask for help. They feel like they have no one and... Well, you take you to <laughs> to get the pension. To get the pension, yeah, like yeah. Yvonne wasn't even on the pension when she came, so... It, it just goes to show that it can happen to anyone and um, it's actually quite confronting to know that it can happen to anyone, your mum, your grandmother. It's, it's, it's scary. Thanks, Yvonne. I know that was no, difficult. It's okay, Lola. Thank you. You can see, though, why anybody would love her. <laughs>